Hi, it's a video review for this kitchen conversion chart. Hopefully you can hear me okay. I'm having allergy issues. Um, but I just wanted to show you. I've had this for a little while now, and I've, I really got to gotta hang it up on the wall at some point, so I thought I'd better review it. But here's the... This is how it arrived in this tube like this, and I've had it out a couple times now with the help of my daughter. There we go. So it's packaged very well, we'll start there. And then here you can see it's the cooking measurement conversion, conversion chart. And on here, and the pattern is really cool by the way. Lay it flat. I need to get a, I'm gonna get a frame for this because I really like the look of it design wise, but then also it's helpful and it looks cool. So it shows you right here, a smidgen is smaller than a pinch which is smaller than a dash, and it tells you how many smidgens and how many pinches equal a dash, all the way up to a teaspoon. And then you can go back and forth all the way down here to a full gallon, and you can just follow the chart up to here. You know there's eight pints in a gallon, and um, two quarts and a half gallon. It's really cool. Love the colors on this. I have a 50s kitchen and it's actually going to fit in really well with that. And it's it's useful. That's the biggest part. Um, the material that this is made out of, it's not really cardstock. It's a thick paper, but it's got like a matte finish to it. So if you are going to hang this in your kitchen, it would be a good idea to frame it um, just because of grease and all that other good stuff that happens in a kitchen. But you can see it there. Down there is that information. But if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. I'll try my best to help you out. I have the measurements on there because that's important to know. And um, I think that's it. But for now, let's see if I can get the whole thing on the shot. Kind of. There we go. I hope this was helpful.